No one ever stood up to the Cobras, and Jeff Hanna was one of their best. You and me, we get the gospel. Like brothers, they fought side by side. And Hanna even enjoyed it for a while. Hey, it's not we want. I'm gonna hurt him. No. It took all the courage he had to stop fighting. Don't walk on me, bro! Now, what would it take to survive the most dangerous time of his life? A time of vengeance. Cinco says you're a dead man. Deception. Cinco's word against mine, and I got a damn good reason to lie. A time of truth. You're trying to scare me. You're doing a terrific job. I don't want to scare you. I just want you to know how things stand. It begins at 3.15. Hold it right there, gentlemen. Take this. You know what? That shit. And just stop. <laughs> You're dead, motherfucker. You are dead, I'm dead. Time to die, Anna. I'm guaranteed dead man if word gets out of Menard. All I got now is a cobra's on me. If I testify, it'll be the whole damn school. Stop. <laughs> Please don't get involved. I'm not fighting anyone. He's gonna pay for this. You tell Jeff I need to talk to him in the Zero Club tonight. It's about Cinco. I got out, and he can't stand it. And just for the fun of it, he's gonna get Sherry. It's simple. Either you take them out or they take you out. Either way, it's over real quick, right? 3.15. He turned his back on the gang. Now, he's the only one who stands in their way. It begins at 3.15, if it's ever going to end. 3.15.